Welcome back to The Sims 4 High School Years of Rags to Riches. Today, we're gonna continue the family life. You guys really wanted to see more Addison and Brienne like skilling up and being as best as they can be before just aging them up. So we're gonna focus on that today. Wait a second, is that? Mum is here, yeah! We haven't seen mum in a while. Oh, that's so sad. Addison doesn't even know his grandma. Go say hi, little Addy. And where, oh no, you're angry. Oh, you're hungry. Didn't we just eat at the end of last part? I, I mean, obviously not. <laughs> I mean, obviously we didn't, but I thought we did. All right, let's get you some fried chicken sliders. Mm -mm. No, no, no sleepy time. No, 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 sleep. Yeah, there you go. No sleepy time. Now right, you got those. Hi, Grandma. Um, yeah, you don't need to knock on the door. I'm right here. <laughs> you can talk to me, Grandma. Also, why do we not have a porch light, by the way? <laughs> it's like super dark out there. I said I don't have any, do I not have any outside lights at all? That's the other thing we should, uh, do probably soon. I do want to move. We, we definitely need some more space. We already have lights in there. It's fine. We definitely need more space. Um, might do two lights here just so it's extra bright. Yeah, that's a bit better. Yeah, this house is a little small now, I think. Uh, do you want to go say hi to mom? Oh, become best friends. Yeah! I think I still have the best friends mod, so that should be all right. Hey, wait, why are these back? Yeah, isn't that, is that the bug that I was talking about? How like you turn off wants and fears and then they just show up again? It's not on. So, hey mom. I don't know why we're all facing the same direction. It's a little awkward, but um, oh, actually the other thing we wanted to do, we wanted to buy eventually the Big Wallet Emporium in Oasis Springs. I think, wasn't it like 200 grand or something? 254,000. It won't actually take us that long because we're pretty close. <laughs> we're making money so quick. We've got 158 and we make like, what, 20 grand a day on his books. And then how much did we make going to work? Well, we make $2,000 an hour, 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Was that like $16,000 or something? <laughs> I don't know, roughly. So yeah, it won't take us long to get that, which is good. In the meantime, uh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, and you guys are also saying apparently with the bed, also I think, oh no, I think cat's eating. <laughs> I leave you guys alone for like one second. Did you finish your food or did Kevin interrupt you? You didn't even get to finish it. Kevin, I'm trying to eat my food. Thank you. Uh, and the buddy's just eating the rest of it. There's only one left anyway. Yeah, uh, apparently uh, with the toddler bed, if we have it in the middle of a room so both sides are accessible, supposedly read to sleep works better that way. So maybe we just go ahead and move uh, at this point. So I might grab all the important stuff. Hang on, let me just turn on all lights. I know we kind of just did all this, but let's also grab this. We'll grab that one. Um, I mean, nothing else is, re oh. <laughs> No, yeah, all these diplomas, we'll grab those and awards that we somehow got. And that, um, I think that's it. I think the rest is just stuff we bought, which is fine. And we can just buy it again. E and look, we can always come back and get stuff. I think we can probably, oh, we'll get our date bucket too. Let's get that. Uh, we can always magic stuff. And by that, I mean, we can steal it with magic. So I, as far as moving, I, get, I was kind of thinking, what if we just go to this house here? which is currently a rental and we could get that and then maybe we could like rebuild or renovate at some point because otherwise the only other places we could move is maybe there but we'd have to kick the price family out which is the whole thing i don't really want to do that um or we go to the park and just <laughs> buy up the park and live there but i think maybe for now we just go here i'm gonna make it uh Oh, it is residential. Why did I think it was rental? Maybe I already changed it. I think I already changed it at some point. All right, well, I guess what we'll do, we'll probably change this up so it's sort of more in line with what we actually need for our house. Like, I think I'll get rid of this sunken dining area here and maybe turn that into, I'm just gonna, like, we're not living here yet, but I'm just gonna furnish it now, cause may as well. So we need a play tent. You know what, I might be better off actually raising this up and removing this fence just so just so it's open to the same space just because it gives us a bit more a bit more floor space to work with and i might change these couches around oh yeah the new the new couch from uh the desert lux kit which is no longer free so if you missed out on desert lux kit i'm sorry uh we probably don't need a bar the bar kind of made sense in because this is like a rental house so that'd be a lot of fun for people coming on holiday renting having a bar would be sweet but uh, for a family home, maybe not. Let's change that wall. What do we got? So we got those big columns. What about these doors? I might change these. And I think I'll change these wooden walls to our classic white. <laughs> okay, I don't know if I, uh, opening it up like that, I don't know if that's actually the best decision. I don't hate it. Also just gonna make sure this is part of the room as well. And just close off that. So we got, this is actually kind of handy having this down here. We've got like a movie room, but I think we'll turn that into like a gym. Really makes more sense. 
So then Kevin can have his gym down there. A lot of people also suggested that Kevin should open up his like own yoga studio or like teach yoga or something like that, which I think is a great idea. So I think we'll look into that. You know, what? I might change this middle section to like the paneled wall. because I think that kind of suits it a bit. And then I might just make these doors white, maybe. I don't know if I'm just making this house really bland. <laughs> But I'm making it Reginald and Kevin styled. I think this, I quite, I quite like this archway actually. So I might put that in. Maybe just have it all open plan, but these have more sort of defined doorways. I don't know, I just kind of like that better. Okay, back to the living room. I, need, I do need to finish this up. I, I kind of started doing all this and I, I didn't really get anywhere. So I'm gonna do this living room real quick. Actually, the other thing I wanna to add to this house is another bathroom, because it's only got one bathroom upstairs. So maybe we turn this little nook that used to be a reading nook into just a second bathroom. I think that'll actually be quite handy. Just gonna copy the styling from that room. Up the door there, I think. So it's sort of tucked away. That means we can sort of put stuff on this wall here as well. I wonder if we could, can we put the dining table here? Kind of, it's a, that's probably too squish. I was just thinking, cause then we could use this room for something else. All right, so we just got a little bathroom there. That's good. Living room is still looking pretty bland. I mean, we have a few decorations to add when we move in. Let's get a picture on the wall, maybe. Sure, and then we'll get a TV up there. Pretty high, but you know. <laughs> It's a fireplace, so it is what it is. All right, then we need like a computer and all that kind of stuff, which I don't think this house had. So um, we kind of got this dead space here in the middle now, the way because the way I've done this. What if I? I'm not really sure what's going on here. Maybe hang on, let's go upstairs. So yeah, we got the way this works is like there's a balcony up here. Uh, I don't think we really need this half wall here, so I'm going to remove that, and then maybe we could turn this into a study nook. It's kind of random right by the front door, but. You know, we kind of got a space there for it. We may as well use it and I'll move this picture. I guess I should bring my laptop because we have, a, we already bought the expensive laptop, so I'll bring that with me. All right, little study. You know, it's kind of nice by the window, not too shabby. It's a bit random, like I said, a little random <laughs> by the door, but that's okay. I might add, let's get, oh, get the Bigfoot one. Yes, get this guy down here. So I turn this into like a little play area. Actually, you know what, I'm gonna move this, maybe not next to the fireplace. I just kind of want, I want a dollhouse here as well because we had that in the previous house. So nice big dollhouse again would be good. All right, fine, it's gonna go there. This is play imagination center and then weird living area <laughs> that I've got there. I mean, I guess we can still have play stuff here because this is, again, it's kind of a random space right here. And we get some of the uh, activity tables in. Or not some, we'll get one maybe. We definitely need the science kit again. Maybe that should just go outside though. Because we've got undercover area here. You know what, I'll just put this here so we can keep doing our science. Got a little craft table here. I don't This is kind of a random spot here. I, don't, I feel like there should be something more <laughs> going on here. Maybe I'll just put this here. It's behind the couch. There you go. Beautiful. And a nice colorful rug. How about that? That's good. All right, the dining area actually already has a high chair in it, which is interesting. I don't know if we'll actually use it, but I'm going to leave that there. The kitchen is fine. I think the rest of that's probably good, and we'll add stuff as we go. Upstairs, uh, I guess main bedroom there is fine. Uh, we don't need all these bunk beds, so I'm going to turn... I think these rooms are pretty similar size. I'll turn this one into the toddler's room, so I'm going to get rid of that. Actually, I'm going to get the same flooring as downstairs. I just swapped the flooring out to something a little less busy, which I just prefer. I don't mind the outside one being like that, because it kind of looks like maybe it's more weathered. But inside, I prefer the sort of, you know, this flooring. All right, so this time when we put the bed in the... Hey, there's no wallpaper there. When we put the bed in the room, I'm going to have access on both sides, so here and here, and then hopefully that'll work, right? And we already have like the blaffy downstairs and the tent. We do need a potty, which I guess, I'll just put it in the room because it'll just be easier. I don't think we really need anything else. Oh, maybe get a nice bookcase so we can get a book to read. I'll put it here because I don't think we're actually using this. I think that's a dresser, but I don't think we'll be using that. So it should be all right. All right, so bookcase, potty, access to both sides of the bed. Some sweet wall decorations. What else we got? What is this? Little, little thingamajigs. There you go. Colorful rug with circles, a circle rug. This is making it more interesting, you know? All right, and then in here is Addison's room. So Addison did have a sweet desk set up. Not sure what desk we ended up using, but is this one. Does that fit under here? It does. Here we go. We'll have to make sure to upgrade the beds again because it's probably gonna be a really low quality bed. All right, so Addison had this, that computer there. Oh yeah, he had like a solid back desk, didn't he? But that's all right, we'll, we'll go with this one now. The sweet gaming chair. Get some sweet gamer lights and tryhards on the wall. Very nice. Get them over here too. It's a bit of fun. Oh, you know what we should get? A little monster lights so they don't have nightmares. One there and we'll get one in here too, which I'll just put over here. There we go. No need to be scared, guys. Might just change this so it looks, you know, a little bit more fun. Uh, and then, oh, they both have clocks in the room. That's interesting. Cool. <laughs> Cool. I don't know. I don't know what else we need. I might just leave that for now and then we could obviously just add stuff in because um, we don't need to go full decoration mode. But I think we got everything we need up there. 
But down here, we're going to remove... Nope. Uh, remove all the stuff out of this room. At least the entertainment stuff that we don't need. And this will become... I'm just going to make it a little bit wider. Our home gym. Which, you know what? I'll just copy from my other house. That's what I'm going to do. All right, let's go back. 84,000. Pretty, pretty cheap, actually. All right. Well, I guess it's time that we move house. Um, just make sure, I guess I gotta make sure that, oh yeah, I need to grab the laptop. That's what I wanted. I'm gonna grab the laptop. Um, although I did notice this place is a lot more colorful. So I think I'll, I might make uh, Addison's room a little bit more colorful and also uh, Brianne's too. Just a bit more fun. Uh, but like I said, we'll probably adjust it as we're there. I don't think there's really anything else we need. I mean, they, they are big into hot tub. So maybe we need a hot tub somewhere, but. We'll figure that out. Uh, that's pretty good. That's kind of that's kind of it. It's a small house. Let's move. All right, so we're going to move right here to Hillside Haven. Uh, we're going to sell my furniture because I don't need that. And oh, we need stuff for the cat as well. Can't forget that. And we're going to move into the furnished home right here. All right, here we are. Hillside Haven. It's a pretty dang nice house. A lot bigger than our last one. Uh, but I think what I would like to do is get that gym in. I did actually copy the gym. So I just copied it here. And I was thinking, I actually don't want it in the basement because it kind of, it was so nice before that it was like upstairs and you had a view. So I might put it out here somewhere. I'm going to move this tree because I like the tree, but I feel like we could get the gym here somewhere. Kind of similar to how we had it before, like just slightly attached to the house, you know? All right, so let's grab this. I'm going to put it, I guess this way. Yeah, <laughs> nice. <laughs> we're like we're taking our gym with us. When we move out, it's coming with us. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to move these stairs to there. Then hope that I can just slide this, oh, slide this whole section to here. I mean, I guess I could leave the stairs where they were. I, I thought that would come with me, but I could just do that. And then that works. Um, and I think I'll maybe match the house a little bit better too. So, so it looks like part of it. All right. And then we'll grab one of these, pop it on there, drag it across, fix the Eve as well. Cool. So we've got our little gym there. Pretty much, I mean, if you look at the other house, it's going to be the exact same gym, but... <laughs> We have the science thing in there, which I'm going to get rid of because we actually put one over here, which is fine. We don't have a hot tub. Is a concern. Hey, we got this computer here too. How did that get in here? I guess I can sell them. Oh, no, it just deleted them from here. Okay, never mind. For some reason, it just did that. Uh, we got this bed, which I believe was actually a fully upgraded bed already, but I guess we're not going to be using it, so I'm just going to get rid of it. All right, we need all my diplomas and stuff. Let's go get on the stairs. Here we go. I do need to go back and get the... Um, I don't know, I'm just lining the wall here. It's all just gonna go there. I need to go back and get the uh, high school picture because I do have older saves that I can just go back into and get his high school graduation picture. So maybe I should do that. Okay, good news everyone. We've got the picture back. <laughs> I saved it as a little room so we can grab it. Hey! Well, we did have it back, but huh, okay. If I go into live mode, does it work now? Hmm. What if I add frame? And change it. Well, as you can see, I did have it and it's quite clearly right there, but it doesn't transfer, which I thought it did. I don't know, that picture was always kind of a little bugged. I guess it's gone forever. It's in our older saves, but I don't know how to bring it into the new save. If anyone knows, let me know. Maybe we just make it custom content and just <laughs> have to put it in that way. Why does this, every time we come back into this lot, this bed is like reset, which is actually super annoying. Um, I'm thinking we just let's just get rid of this. Let's just go back to what we had, which annoyingly I now sold the fully upgraded version of the bed because we had this bed and I had a spare one in my inventory. But uh, anyway, whatever. So we did this. We had it in yellow. <clears throat> we had it in yellow. I think I'll put the desk there instead. And then I'm going to do the same wardrobe that we had in the old house just here. And that was also a nice yellow. And you know what? I want to have... Uh, actually, let's put the desk here. Hopefully that still works. Let me move these things. Let's put it above. Hopefully this still works with the door and the, the bed because I want to maybe change some of these windows to like the breakout windows or the sneak out, I shouldn't say breakout, the sneaking out window. Which to do that, we have to have a flat surface here, which is kind of annoying. But we could change this window to the one that has a little flappy corner. This one here, the little flappy. That means I can climb through it. Put that there. It means I have to do the same window here, even if they can't use this one. But otherwise it just looks weird having different windows. So and that one, I guess. Oh, I don't know if it works with blinds over this, but I'll put it on these ones. All right, so that gives us an opportunity to have Addison sneak out here. What I might do is have like the roof on that section. And then maybe here we could do... Let's get rid of these. We got we got to disguise it because we got to have a way for them to actually sneak out. Because they can, if they can climb through the window, that's good. 
But I still need a way to climb down. We're gonna use the ladder for that, of course. Like that, there you go. Maybe make it, should we make it more brown so it blends in a bit more? And then we need the matching ones. There we are. Let me just get a little taller one here just to blend it in. Um, I might remove this fence because it looks a little strange. I guess maybe this should just be a balcony because otherwise, kind of like what's going on there, you know? But then I'm like, why would it be a balcony with no door? Hmm, I don't really know how to disguise this. <laughs> Cause I guess that's supposed to be like the roof. What if we just have this little bit here and then, <laughs> I don't know. What do we do with this? That doesn't look sus at all, does it? Nah, it's, it's fine. No one will notice. I don't know. If you have any other ideas, let me know. Anyway, that will allow him to sneak out the window. That's the idea. So <laughs> sneak out the parties. We also had, is it this? I think it's this rug. Yeah. We had this rug in Addison's room. So I'm just gonna actually get the same one, but size it down so it fits. Definitely a smaller room than the old house, but you know, it is what it is. All right, we have the computer, we do. And I'll keep this kit in the new gamer chair because we had a different chair before, but I'll use this one. Okay, blue. Okay, hopefully that all works. Obviously we'll have to test to make sure that's all good. But I think this is a nice starting point. We can also pretty easily expand this house. Like there's definitely room here to add another bathroom or something, or we can expand out this way for sure. So definitely got room. All right, what I'm gonna need to do now, Reginald, you're gonna need to upgrade all these beds. Uh, let's instant upgrade. Oh wait, we can't instant upgrade beds? The heck? Yeah, I can instant upgrade like the tub, but not a bed. Ugh, okay. And a manual upgrade. All right, Kevin, do you wanna make some dinner? Do we do we have leftovers still? Do they carry over between fridges and moving? Oh, it actually does. Oh, okay, well, <laughs> I didn't expect that, so that's good. All right, you get leftovers. How are you doing? You're pretty good. Do you wanna go make believe? Or actually play dolls with Kevin. That'll be nice. Yeah, there you go. Go do that. All right, so everyone's doing, oh, cat stuff, cat stuff. I nearly forgot. Just saw a little buddy there, can't forget him. Get our little laser beam cat litter box, which I guess I'll put out on the back porch. Uh, <laughs> I'll put it next to the science thing. It's okay, it won't smell because the lasers clean it every time. And we need a food bowl, which I guess can go in the dining area, really. There's not really any room in the kitchen, all like through here. It's just a bit random in the middle here. Maybe here, underneath the hat rack. It's a bit random, but you know, we don't actually use uh, hat racks in the game. Like it's just decorative, so who cares? <laughs> oh, scratching post. Or actually, you know what? We might be able to fit a whole cat tree. Let's get a big cat tree, let's do it. Um, having said that, <laughs> what if we move some of this stuff? Because it should be in like the living room. Like, can we put it here? That'd be nice. Get rid of that. Move this bookcase here. And then we just have this little armchair. It's a bit random, but we will put it there. <laughs> Our living room just got really small all of a sudden, but whatever. Okay, they've just canceled their interactions. And you did too. And you did too. Right, everyone stopped what they were doing annoyingly. Wait, can I magic upgrade this? Oh, I can only inferniate it. Dang it. What's the point of magic if I can't just magic stuff? Oh, I need to put my laptop here. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna put it up here. We got this whole space up here as well. I'm gonna put it here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna swap the door and the window because then this is just like a little nook that we can use. Yeah, that's better. Sweet. And I can put this here and I can get this thing. <laughs> get out. Uh, oh, our prom saxophone thing. Saxophone thing, what am I talking about? Vinyl record player. It, I don't have any surfaces in this house to place it on. I don't wanna put it on the dining table or in the, <laughs> there. Okay, I need like, it's a little table or something, guys. Yeah, but this wooden cube thing. We can just sit in this corner. Kind of, kind of blends in and then we can put this on it. There you go. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> oh no, did we all cancel our interactions again? Guys, can we just, okay, you do that. Okay, you are eating, which is good. And you need to not do whatever you're trying to do and go upgrade your son's bed, please. Okay, my question is, can we not get to the doll thing? Is that chair in the way now? I can't even seem to click on it. I can't even, oh, there we go. Oh, wait. Okay, so Kevin can't seem to click on this at all, which is interesting. Um, all right, well, Addison's finished dinner, which is good. Go fill up the food for the kitty. All right, what if I just get rid of that chair? Is that in the way? I still can't click on it. It's really weird. Hang on, let's just cancel that for a second. All right, there we go. All right, and I'm hoping as well, by moving the toddler bed later on, we can do a... Oh, did I lose a light here? It's really dark in this corner now. I think there used to be a light, but I got rid of it by accident. Um, yeah, I hope we can do read to sleep without it glitching out. That'd be nice. Uh, that's not your bed, dude. Have you done your homework? Yes, you have. You wanna go, here, go take a shower or something. <laughs> you don't really need to, but dad's still busy upgrading a bed, so. Let me go play some computer games. Play some maths, cause you were pretty, you were pretty bad at that last time, so. Now, you guys suggested as well, we should try and do Addison's uh, asp aspiration, which I guess we can try and work through that. What do we actually have to do? So obviously those two are fine. Level five mental skill, finish homework two times off focus. That's all right. Achieve grade A, craft three emotional potions. Achieve level 10 mental skill. Okay, we can probably do that. And you guys suggested as well on Sunday, we should age up. So it's Monday now, so we have a full week, age up and do it that way. 
So hopefully we can get it all done within the week and maybe we'll go from there. Now what's going on down? Oh my gosh, why did you put her in a high chair? That's a risk. Okay, seems to be working though, which is unusual. Right, well, you get some leftovers. She's probably gonna finish that in like a second. I gotta keep an eye on that. Now there's that bed upgraded. Now we're gonna do the second upgrade. All right, we're gonna, I'm just gonna go through an auto light all the bedrooms as well. For some reason, Kevin took his food all the way outside to eat and you need to let out the toddler now. You tired? Actually, actually, you know what? Yeah, let, well, let's do let out. We're gonna do that first anyway. I feel like we need a door here because he has to walk all the way around to get to this table. Or like a door from the kitchen. Actually, a door here would be really good because we've got stairs. Let's add a door in. It's gonna do the same as the front door right there. Because then that means he can just go up this way to get to the gym and to the, the, the barbecue area and all that. All right, let's try this. Let's say a moment of truth. Read, there's no option to read to sleep, but I'll click on the bed and do it that way. Read Brianne to sleep. All right, come on, come on, let's go. Let's read. It seems to be working because, oh, <laughs> all right. Uh, okay, uh, ready? Okay, come on, second half's the charm, let's go. Okay, so far, oh. No, it doesn't work guys. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what you're supposed to do to get it to work. We have access on both sides of the bed. And right, what I'm gonna do is gonna say, put Brienne down here. We'll just take her all the way upstairs. I'm surprised he didn't try to put, I'm gonna put that fish back in the fridge too. Surprised he didn't put her down first before picking her up again. Hey, I'm to level five. Awesome, halfway to level 10, which is great. All right, here we go. Now let's try read to sleep. Now that we're like in the room, let's see. Okay, a little glitchy on the pickup, but it definitely works now. I don't, I don't know. Maybe just being on a different level of the house. Maybe if we're always on the upstairs, it'll work. Who knows? The walls out. We've got a lot of tall items here. It's kind of hard to see. I might, I don't know. I feel like we need to, we probably just need to build our own house at some point. How's that upgrade going? It's going all right. Now Kevin, oh, level five imagination, sweet. So she is maxed out on the imagination, uh, lacking on movement and potty a little bit, although potty's in the other three, so that's all right. Uh, but that's okay, we can definitely do all that. All right, Kev, you, yeah, you're gonna, you still need to actually go eat. So yeah, you go do that. All right, you finish that now. Let's go instant upgrade the toilet. Although it doesn't instant upgrade add the thing that makes it catch fire. I don't remember. I guess we'll find out. There right, you go sleep. Hey cat. Did that add the fire? Uh oh yeah, composting. Yeah, so instant upgrading toilet, probably not a good idea. Cause this one, the composting container, the composting container makes this toilet use less water and produce flammable compost. That's the problem. Just to be sure to ins install an insect farm or things could get toasty. Uh, yeah, that's a little rough. You know what, let's get an, in let's get an insect farm. That's what it says. I guess we'll put it here. Uh, I'm gonna farm some grubs or beetles. What did I put in there? I don't know. Put in grubs, very good. Uh, magic, no, 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 don't infer any of it. Let's nurture them. Yeah. Now this bed is not gonna be very good, but I guess we, you know, we're gonna deal with what we got to start off with here. Oh, I should probably move that monster light because we don't have a bunk bed anymore. Adjust these panels a little bit. I don't really have room for the height of it, but whatever. I get it. Oh, look at the little grubbies. Oh, he's a cute little grubby. There you go. All right. So what, does this make my toilet not catch fire now? I don't really know how that works, but anyway. Probably shouldn't have done the instant upgrade. That was, <laughs> that might've been a mistake. Do we have a fire alarm in this house? Uh, I don't know that we do. Also, we need to upgrade the fireplace. Oh, burn money. Oh, look at the cat go. Buddy loves running around. It's amazing. All right, let's go to sleep. All right. All right, Addison is up. Good morning. You can go to the toilet. Reginald is up as well. No, don't do a quick meal. Can you actually serve some more food? Because I think we're out of food. So let's serve breakfast. Breakfast scramble, yum. All right, do you wanna, you should probably get to know uh, little buddy a little bit better. All right, Kev, what are you up to? What's your thing today? I feel like we need to be working with uh, little Brienne to work on our skills. So, oh, let's say potty. She does not need to go potty at all. I'll let her sleep a bit more. She's not quite awake yet. Oh, who's a good kitty? Who's a good kitty catty? That's right, you are. <laughs> does this still have the like, lock on it? Yeah, it does. Yeah, that computer's locked, which is good. You know what, I might actually lock this computer, everyone but Addison, because otherwise I'm gonna have every single sim trying to use that computer too. All right, uh, how's breakfast going? Gonna go, here we go, yeah, go grab a serving. Apparently we're eating outside this morning. It's a beautiful chilly day. Oh, we should go back to go back to the old thrift tea store, or I guess go back to our own thrift store and uh, buy some more, some more thrifted stuff. Buddy's on the loose again. Let's go, <laughs> wee. All right, so you're done. Oh, look at this, father and son, toe and toe. I see him, oh no, I see him you're after school and work. You're not, you're gonna go play dolls. That's cool. What are you doing? Use the toilet and then play dolls. Nice, I don't think you're gonna have time to play dolls though. So we're just not gonna do that. All right, it's 8 a.m., which means it's time 
for school and work. Now you have done everything you need to. Your skill is already up to level two. We got a performance. We're definitely gonna be B student today. I mean, we already got the resolution for being a B student. So I don't know. Anyway, Kevin is in the gym. <laughs> I like how this is just copied and pasted from the last house. Got a little bit of uh, shrubbery coming through. Yes, I'll move that a little bit, put it there. We just copied and pasted that, that's fine. Now you do wanna do your knitting. We gotta actually get onto that. Okay, now that Actually, is it just in his inventory? Uh, yeah, we got the knitting basket. Maybe we need a rocking chair out on the balcony. Uh, where do we find... Oh, here we go. Rocking chair. I guess just one without a cushion probably is a good idea. Uh, let me replace one of these. All right, so let's go here. We're going to say knit. Resume knitting project. Got apparently a couple things we're working on. Oh, you're awake. So that means we need to work on stuff. If you're hungry, do you want to finish eating that? Don't know where you're going. Are you going around the other side of the bed? Yeah. <laughs> All right, Addison at school. Actually, I was going to say study hard, but I guess he doesn't actually need to because he's already got the performance, so that's fine. All right, Brianne, it's going to be fine after that. Oh, Dad's already here. Okay, I didn't actually expect you to come up here. Uh, well, what you can do is um, let's do potty train. And she doesn't actually need to go to the toilet, but let's do it because... No, she's taking the plate, put it somewhere. Yeah, just dump it in your brother's room. That's fine. That's cool. <laughs> I get it. All right, let's do a potty train. Get that skill up a little bit. Yeah, let's go. All right, so potty train. And then you want a bath as well. You don't need to ask for it. I'll just give you one. I'll say, uh, give Brianna a bath. There we go. A little bit stinky. Ooh, here we go. Red Journal needs to provide tough feedback to a coworker. Straight and honest. Performance gain, medium, medium. Let's go. We're going to get another raise today. <laughs> Got a pretty good performance. All right, she's now level two potty. Another 21 grand from our royalties. Good. Does Kevin need to go as well? He just gave me a little potty thing. Oh no, he's good. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do that. So he's down any second now. Any second now. Any second. Well, this is taking longer than I thought it would. There we go. Yeah. All right, let's go for a little bath. Doesn't build a skill, unfortunately. Though I guess it probably gives you attention and stuff, which is good. You got plenty of that. Kevin's also building skill. I guess he's building parenting. What would assume. All righty, there we go. Now let's uh, say pick up. Oh, hey mom, wanna go to Geek Hunt? No, I'm kind of busy. Uh, pick up, there you go. And we're gonna say, let's just go downstairs where there's just more room. Uh, put Brian down here. Ah! <laughs> it's like dragging along his feet. All right, then if we do play, I think that's the one that gets us more movement skill. Yeah, nice. There we go. And parenting level seven as well, very nice. Brienne can now climb stairs, which is also useful. We can p apparently play wrestle. I don't know, does that do better movement skill? Gee. So we can also play wrestle with an adult. I don't know where that option is. I can't seem to find it. Funny? No, it's not funny. Like I have play, unless it's the same thing. I don't know. You know what, let's be a creep. Let's go watch, because I think he's going to the toilet. Oh no, he's just watching, getting a drink, I think, or getting a glass of water. Because we've got to get that thinking skill up. Oh yeah, there it goes. Yeah, it's going up. Can I watch the cat? No, I can't. Where are you going, dude? Why is, oh, he's going all the way upstairs just to put a glass down. <laughs> oh, here we go, we've got another fear. <laughs> Even though fears are off. So what you have to do is go gameplay on off, I think, right? Yep, there they go. <laughs> so that's a nice little bug too. Good times, good times. All right, just trying to watch. Kevin, sit. And then also we'll do another play session, get some more movement skill. It's pretty good, like 60%. And then Kevin, can you stop going to eat? It's really selfish. <laughs> I need you to stay still so I can just watch. I should probably also get those blocks back again. Yeah, so we can play with these too. Put them there. Kevin, stop, sit, good boy. <laughs> what if we, uh, so wait, which one gets us? So shapes is thinking, okay. We practice shapes. Does that like help us get it quick? Cause I still feel like just doing watch is like the quickest. No, oh, she didn't want to do it anyway. <laughs> uh oh, Kevin's angry too. Now we're going. Oh wait, we're doing it anyway. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> It's definitely slower. Should Addison invite over? Oh, Hillary's coming over. Yeah. That's not Hillary. Hillary? <laughs> Grades are up. Sweet. Where's Hillary? You said you're inviting Hillary over. Aw, she didn't come. That's so sad. Yeah, I guess it said, do you want to invite, should he invite Hillary? It didn't say, she will say yeah. Oh no, she's here. Yeah. All right, screw homework. Let's hang out. At least you're going over here. Thinking level three. Okay, you can now learn numbers from flashcards and sleeps better through the night. Fantastic. All right, well, you're super angry. So let's um, let's do a thing where we say, pick up. Are you hungry as well or just tired? Mostly tired, a little bit hungry. Hillary's got the creative trait, very nice. All right, then I'm gonna say, put Brienne here. And then we'll try to read to sleep. Let's try that, maybe that'll work. She looks a little sad. Can we cheer her up? Try to cheer her up, there we go. It's okay, Hillary. I know. My dad's are cooler than your dad, but you know, kind of all have it as good as me. <laughs> Aww. 
It's okay, Hillary. One day we'll be teenagers too. That'll be sweet. Oh, there you go. She's feeling better. Let's discuss fractions. So how about that denominator? <laughs> Am I right? Pretty crazy. All right, do we have any things that kids can do here? <laughs> like together? I don't like kids stuff. What, what do kids do? Kids activities. We could get a swing set. Yeah, a puppet show. Can we do puppets together? That'd be kind of cute. I have room. I need my house to be bigger. We could. Hang on. Let me, I'm going to put the science table back in there for now, just for now. So we could actually expand the wall here and turn this into a, an extra part of the house. Then we have a little bit more space. I actually don't know if that really helps, to be honest, because it's kind of like an awkward space. <laughs> And the door is right there. That, I feel like that didn't help. <laughs> but if we move this over here and have the puppet theater here, or we just shove the table down this end of the room, the dining room, and have the puppet theater in here. <laughs> there we go. So really, I didn't need to do this, but now, now we've got more room. I don't know, I feel like we probably need to do either just build a whole new house or just do a massive renovation at some point just to make it work better for our needs. Let's go, I like kind of like the pink one. I like that one. Right, can we do a show together? Is that something we can do? Farm puppet show. Oh, can't do it together. The only reason I got it is because I wanted to do it together. I'm going to perform a school live puppet show for Hillary. I'll, I'll do a puppet show for you. How about that? That's kind of cute. Oh yeah, we earned a raise. So we got $17,800 and we now make $2,040 an hour. Good job, buddy. All right, you also stink. Can we upgrade this? I oh, can't instant upgrade yet. All right, you go take a shower. Did, did read to sleep work? Uh, I don't think it did. <laughs> How's the puppet show going? Yeah! Oh, that's kind of cute. It's our big day at school. There was a mean teacher and she said I had to do homework. Actually, can we do homework together? Like if I say actions form group. Oh, I guess I could have just add to group. Can I say do homework together? Yeah, read through homework together. Because then we can like, you know, hang out, help each other with our homework, all that kind of stuff. Uh oh, the puppet's not on. The puppet, the puppet. Uh oh, ah, there it is. Whew. Not sure how long this show goes for. All right, can we try and do at least one? Oh, I didn't come and upgrade parts. I suppose this is where the benefit of bringing my stuff that I already upgraded with would have come in handy instead of having to do it all over again. I don't know how much of this other stuff I need, so I'll just get some of it. Yeah, man, this is a long puppet show, dude. Should we maybe like get to homework now? <laughs> Are you gonna do your homework too? We're supposed to be doing it together. All right, do you wanna do the other upgrade as well? Do you wanna do your homework with me or? Um, Reginald, what are you doing? You're supposed to be upgrading the bed. <laughs> He's like, why are you hanging out with Hillary? I said, no son in my house will hang out with Sydney's children. Oh, look at the little buddy going up with Reginald right behind. That's kind of cute. <laughs> oh, I should really get rid of the school project too. I don't need that. I guess maybe Hillary just doesn't have homework because she's doing her own thing. Oh, you're up again? Oh, you're hungry. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, all right, it's okay. I'll get you some food. All right, it's okay. Here you go. Yeah, there you go. Cool. And then you can go back to sleep and you're doing the bed upgrade. And once you've done that, then you can go to sleep and you're doing a your homework. Hillary was also supposed to do a homework, but that's cool. Homework complete. Oh, I'm gonna just monkey around a little bit. Hee hee, hee hee, hee hee, hee hee. What else can we do? Give gift. Can I give you? <laughs> Here, my dad said I could give this to you. Here's $10,000. Why is that even an option for kids, by the way? Check for me? <laughs> to 10 grand. That is ridiculous. She's like, yeah, that's all right. I'll accept it. Cool. You know, we got enough money going around, so it may as well. Can we do, um, play with Hillary? Oh, we can play with a sweet tent. What are you doing up? I thought you're supposed to be sleeping. Do you need to go potty? Hang on. You need potty train Brienne? Kevin, meanwhile, not Kevin. Reginald, meanwhile, is just trying to, like, finish this upgrade so we can go to bed. All right, sleeping. There we go. So that's now fully upgraded bed. That'll be really good. Uh, are we doing a potty train? What's going on down here? I don't know if that worked. Right again. All right, there we go. Oh, look at them in there. <laughs> that's pretty cool. Can the kids go on the rides at the, the amusement park? They can. <gasps> can we go in the tunnel of love? Oh, he's too young. <laughs> they could have had like a little date. All right, you can go to the toilet. You can go home now, Brienne. I'm kind of tired. I should get going. Now. Oh yeah, there you go. All right, see ya. All right, how are you going up here? We'll potty train and then we'll try it. We'll try read to sleep again. I don't know that that'll work, but <laughs> we'll try it. Oh yeah, how, how are our grubs going, by the way? Whoa, there's a lot of grubs. Uh, collection not ready. They're growing. They're fed, which is good. I think we're okay. How does this work with the compostable thing? Does that like automatically feed the bugs or something? I don't know. Oh yes, reading to sleep worked. Yeah. All right, you can go take a shower as well, and then you can hit the hay. Right, you're off to sleep. How are you doing, Kevin? Kevin's pretty good, but you know, might as well just go to sleep as well. Just get everyone in bed at the same time. It's kind of a little bit easier that way. All right, that's pretty good. I think I'll leave this here. We're only on Tuesday. I don't know. Whenever we get to the family. 
portions of the Let's Play, things definitely start taking a little bit longer. But hopefully, what, I, what I'm planning on doing here is hopefully doing a few more videos this week than the previous week so that we can sort of, you know, get through it all, but not take forever doing it, you know. Uh, but I'm pretty happy today. You know, we did a few skill progressions. Reginald <laughs> got promoted to get, oh, got a raise again. Hillary came around to hang out. We got a new house, which I definitely want to work on more. Let me know in the comments down below if we should continue renovating this house and changing it to how we need, or if we should just build a new house or what. I mean, the other option, I guess, is we could just like gut it, remove all the interior, and just replan it out that way. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below. But thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time, and have an awesome day.